all of the directors. You were generous with your time. You were welcoming. You gave us a wealth of information we could not have had otherwise. I really appreciate all of the efforts of the II. Didn't make us feel different, despite a slight complexion difference. <laughs> Particularly, I need to remember that Mr. Nadeep and Miss Miriam came out in the middle of the night to collect us from the airport when we weren't exactly sure we had even gotten onto the right plane and were in the right country. <laughs> Miss, Mrs. Dillum, who helped with translating not just language, but culture. And absolutely. <laughs> Ms. Medica, who not only came with us to the hospitals, to the research institute, she picked up, packed up, and traveled with us around Australia on 12-hour bus rides. <laughs> Sorry, Sri Lanka. Come to Australia, we'll drive around the country. Have you got three months? You know, she came with us, she smoothed the way, she showed us when we needed to rethink maybe a little bit our approach. Australians, very direct. Now you're all sitting there going, oh, wait a minute. This is not an Australian voice. I am a Canadian. I lived in Australia for 17 years. And you wonder why the accent hasn't changed. Sheer force of personality. But I am willing to learn. And what I want to say very, very much, on behalf of all of our students, Bahoma Esitu, Estuti, my apologies. A little bit nervous. I know that's hard to believe. A little bit nervous. Bahoma Estuti, we really appreciate it.